Hi everyone, we will create a form object using the Python custom tick into library. Warning text is displayed on the screen when incomplete information is entered by the user. Also, an error message is displayed on the screen when both genders are selected at the same time. We will rebuild the project step by step together. I shared the source code of the project on GitHub account. You can also subscribe to the YouTube channel for more programming projects. We will create a form object using the Python custom tickinter library. I will transfer the custom tickinter library. We can use the GitHub account to transfer the library. There is a lot of information about custom tickinter in the prepared document. I am using the copied code in the terminal section. I am setting the display property of the window. I will create using the appearance and color theme functions. I am creating a desktop window with the custom tick inter function. I adjust the physical size of the window with the geometry function. I am setting the window of title with the title function. I can display the window on the screen using the mail loop function. We have created an empty desktop window. I will start adding objects in order in a moment. First, I need a frame object. I will create the frame object using the tickinter library. I am transferring the tick into the library using the import keyword. I will use the created frame object in all objects. I will create an entry object for the user to enter a name. I can adjust the physical properties of the objects with the parameter sent to the function. If you have any questions, you can specify them in the comments. The entry object has been created. I will create an entry object for the user to enter a last name. I created the second entry object. I will create an entry object for the user to enter the their age. We have created another entry object for age. 
I will first create a checkbox for male so that the user can choose male or female. I created the checkbox object. I will create a checkbox object for a female using the same function. I am rearranging some places in the function. I also created two checkbox objects. I need a button object. When the button object is clicked, I will show all the information in the label object. I created the button, but it has no function yet. I will add a text function soon. I will create a label object. The information entered by the user will appear in the created label object. Let's add a text function to the button. The text function will be called every time the created button is clicked. I will display the user's age information on the screen. I am transferring the date library for the current date. I am synchronizing the current date with a variable using the date time function. If the information to be entered by the user is not empty, and the mail option is selected, I display the appropriate text in the label object.
If the user entered information is not empty and the female option is selected, I display the appropriate text in the label object. I will issue a warning message if both gender options are selected at the same time. If the user clicks the button without entering any information on some objects, I issue a warning message. I think I made a simple mistake in the if query. All functions work smoothly. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. For more Python projects, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel.